Hey, this is Scott again from OutdoorCookingMagic.com and it is a cold January day, but it suns out and it's a great day to grill. And today we're going to do some um, grilled beef tenderloins with some grilled vegetables. And what I did here was I first took, got a couple grilled tenderloins and I rubbed them with some black pepper and then put them in a, a Ziploc bag with some creamy uh, Caesar dressing, salad dressing and let them in, put it, soak in the uh, fridge for about 30 minutes and now we're going to get ready to grill. Okay, let's get these on. I've got some chicken going too, so I've got several things going today. So we're going to cook these on high heat for a few minutes on either side to get them kind of seared on both sides and then we'll set them to a cooler part of the grill and let them finish cooking. So we'll check back with them in a few minutes. Okay, let's gonna check these, turn them over. And they look great. Alright our tenderloins are just about ready to come off. They are look like they're perfect. And now what we're going to do is I've taken some romaine lettuce, uh, some tomatoes, and some onions. I've cut the tomatoes into about three quarter inch slices. The tomatoes thickly sliced and the romaine lettuce I brushed both sides of each of them with olive oil and uh, put some salt and pepper on them and now we're going to toss them on the grill. I'm going to move these up so they're out of the way. Turn these other steaks over. I'm cooking a bunch of things today. The lettuce won't take long, so I'm going to start with these other vegetables. Whoops! That one fell apart. And that's okay. I think I better do these with my hands. The olive oil will help them kind of get some really nice char and grill marks on them. We'll check them again here in just a minute. Okay, let's check these. Probably could let them go just a little longer. So we're going to let them cook just a bit longer. I keep leaving this thing coping. Ah, that looks good. Just kind of fell apart. I think I could have cut these tomatoes just a little bit thicker. Okay, just about done with the vegetables. Then we're gonna put the, the romaine lettuce on. That only takes about 30 seconds each side and we will be ready to go. Okay, time to pull these off.
Oops. That pretty much fell apart. That's why it needs to be a little thicker. Okay, that's probably enough for right now. I'm going to get this lettuce on. I guess I should have got the rest there. So that I get this one last piece on. Yeah, we'll put that back there. 30 seconds one side, flip them over 30 seconds the other side. Okay, we're gonna flip them over. Ideally, you'll have them just start to get charred just a little bit, but not too much. Thirty more seconds. Okay, here we go. You didn't know you could grill lettuce, did you? That one came out a little burned. That's okay. I should have chopped some of the bottoms of these leaves off. Put our two tenderloins there. Let me get some of these grilled vegetables on. Okay, there we go. Pork ten or some sorry, beef tenderloin with some grilled vegetables and uh, some grilled romaine lettuce. So I I hope you like this dish. Uh, go to Scott at go to outdoorcookingmagic.com and try it. Tell me uh, what you like about it. Uh, maybe you'll change that you made to it. And check uh, that website, our website out for a lot more ideas and recipes for cooking outside. Talk to you later. Bye.